you don't, and you don't, and you don't, you don't put me down. You don't, you don't, you, you don't, you don't um, um, berate me, put me down, and uh, and highlight my negatives. Yeah, go ahead. Humility, connection. Say it, say it one more time. Okay, so you say you, you show them humility, and but nothing goes through to the person. Well. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta ask yourself why. Because sometimes people, sometimes people have have a bad day. Uh, she, she she failed a test. She her boss her boss yelled at her. She she got issues with, with with her family. So there are things that make people a certain way for a short period of time. But if this is ongoing, this is her regular personality. Then nah. You, you gotta take a step back and say that you, you and me are, are, are we, we can't last long term. You can't do it. And you got, and they put it, put it in the friend zone or put her in the no zone. You just not, you just total cut her off out of your life. So either, so you gotta learn how to know how to, how to friend zone, friend zone, friend zone, friend zone them, friend zone them. When, it, when it's time to friend zone them, friend zone them. And don't look back, all right? Don't look back, because she must be a safe place. And if she does not want to listen to you, hear you, she, she's only a friend. She ain't no lover. Friend zone them and keep her that way. You heard? Yeah. You know, like I said before, it don't matter how bad she is, how, that, how bad that booty is, it don't, it don't matter, man. It don't matter. <laughs> it don't matter, man. Because you're going to deal with, yeah, no matter how good the sex is, you're going to deal with her attitude, her lifestyle, her habits. That's what you're really going to deal with, man. Really? You think so? You think so? If you, listen, bro, if you, if you can have all that plus the great sex, why not? Why not? But sometimes we're allowing the romance to, 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 to confuse us and, and, and to keep us in bondage from people that we should have said bye a long time ago to. Long time ago to. Yeah. Because, because we're, 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 too, we're, too, we're too indulging in our, in our hormones and in in us being a f freaky that some people, you know, you, that, that's, that's why like men are, 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 are usually are not going to say, oh, that's that stripper, I'm going to marry her. Usually men don't say that. They say, no. The men say, I'm gonna have my, my way with her and, and, and then that's it. But never 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 wife, no. Because they know that, that she's not a wife material long, she's not wife material at all. So the man will use this woman for their pleasure, but they won't consider them as a, as a long-term partner. Because they know that they're no good. They're no good, they're cheap. They're, they easily give it away. They're, they're not, you know. But then, but then these men, I don't know, go back to school and find nice, educated women in, in, in school, and they're okay. This, this, this is more like it, you know. With, with some character, some decency, you know. Yeah. So that's what it's about, man. That core. Looking beyond the surface.
blessing. Good, good job, good job. Thank you, thank you. Praise the Lord. So, praise Him. Enjoy, enjoy your walk, enjoy your walk. Amen. Nice walk tonight, beautiful night. Amen. Take, hold your girl's hands tonight. Look at her eyes, show them how much you love her, care for her. <laughs> Amen. Amen. Don't lose that, man. Yeah. So don't lose don't don't lose that spark. So like I tell these guys, man, like you gotta enjoy enjoy getting to know her. And, and enjoy being her friend. A lot of guys don't want to do that, man. They want to know. I, I, I'm trying to be more than friends. I'm trying to be more than friends. But well, you got to take your time to know, to collect the data. What do I say? Data. Data, man. To collect data. Are, are you two looking to marry one day? You gonna get married one day? Maybe. You? You don't know? Okay. If you find the right one, a great one, you would do it? You gonna get married? Why not? Really? You're you're what what you a whore? You're a pimp? Don't be a pimp, man. Why you why you a pimp? You get tired of them. You get tired of them? Really? Alright, do, do 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 you get tired do you get do you get tired of your, of yourself? <laughs> you do? Well, you, well guess what? Wherever you go, there you are. <laughs> Wherever you go, there you are. So what, what, what do you get tired of? Exactly, what do you get tired of exactly? I guess it just gets repetitive. Gets repetitive? What, what gets repetitive? I don't know, you pick up on the other's manner. Oh. So you like, so you like on, you like, you like, it, you, you like to be, um, like different, Dif adventurous, adventurous. Okay, so, so you're saying like, like, so, so, so saying you will stop being a, 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 a pi hey, all right, blessing, blessing, all right, bye, good night, good night. So you say you, you, you will stop being a pimp and you find a woman that, that's adventurous? Interesting. Me some new. And, and we do we do the same thing. We do the same thing. Hopefully. Okay. Hopefully. Okay. That's an interesting uh, 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 statement. Um, I agree though that 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 there's some people out there that's bo really boring. Not w not willing to. <laughs> oh no! Forget that, man. If that girl can leave the house, you 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 leave that you leaving her, man. You, you girl, you better leave this house. <laughs> oh, I'm leaving you. <laughs> boring. I ain't trying to go for that boring stuff, man. Like, are we are we like trying to learn how to how to how to fish, ride some bikes together, take a hike together, go go bowling together? Play some board games together, travel together. Uh, I know what else. I mean, I, 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 nah, I ain't saying sky. I ain't saying skydiving. I ain't doing no skydiving. Not me. You, me, you I'll be right here when you, when you get down. <laughs> oh, skydiving. <laughs> you know, in, in, innovation, creativity. You know. You know, a lot of people lose that. So a, 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 a lot, a lot of people lose that as they with somebody for a long time. They, 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 they lose that that freshness. They, they lose that excitement. They, they lose that u uniqueness. They lose it. That, that, that flavor, that, that spice. Yeah. Oh yeah. You, you, wanna, you wanna keep that, that, that spice in that relationship. Yes. Don't lose it, man. Oh, oh yeah. You want that, that, Cajun, that Cajun relationship. Oh, yeah. You want it, man. You, you look, what? You like you like spicy your food? You like spice in your food? Amen. And people like spice in their relationship. Yeah. Amen, man. Amen. So listen. That's why I say it once again. 
be your with me, when you be your friend, we, we look like chill out, like watch this out, watch watch this. When you're somebody's friend, right? When you're somebody's friend, and you're close friends. You usually do things together. You do things together, right? You you know how the person is, like you you got you got friends, right? You know how they are. This person don't do much, but this person does a lot. All right, you you you, you got female friends? You, you got female friends? Yeah. So all of them is different, but in order in order to know more about who they are, you gotta spend time with them. You gotta talk to them. Some of them are like, yo, yo, can we go out and do some have some fun? Can we go out eat somewhere? Whatever, right? Some of them are more laid back and chill. So the ones that are more laid back and chill, you know, to, to, to friend zone, keep it in the friend zone. But for those who are more proactive and take initiative, you will consider maybe going deeper with that one, you know? But like I said, it, 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 it takes time. It takes time to know somebody, to spend time with them, get around them, um, you know? So that's how it is, man. It takes time, so just be just be patient, man. Collect collect that data. Be patient, be patient, because I think a lot of people are with the wrong person today because they were too impatient. Yeah, they were too impatient. Like the girl said, man, I'm I'm, I'm 35. I'm about to I'm about to reach. I'm, uh, 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 menopause is creeping up on me menopause so I, I i i gotta marry somebody and then she settles for the wrong one and then the rest of her life is misery because she settled for the wrong one because menopause was right around the corner uh oh but, but i tell i tell these guys man i, I i'd rather be single and, and 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 super fulfilled rather than with somebody and miserable you know why because my happiness isn't tied to nobody it's tied in god so I can be happy at being single. I, I don't prefer to be single, but I, I'm happy and fulfilled being single. Cause I'm secure in my own skin. I'm secure in my identity being being being, being God's child. A lot of people they, they attach identity to somebody else. Oh, I need to find love, I need I need this, I need a woman, I need I mean, we, we got desire, sure, right? But is that your whole essence? of living and and being you need you need romance is what you need and having babies and that's fine you got desires i i i i admit to that but is that your whole essence reason for living is that it is that it like i think it was you know you know neo was it neo the, the rb singer neo neo you don't know you don't know, you don't know neo the rb singer I think was it Neil? Neil said, Neil said something so powerful in one of his songs. He said, "Um, I, I like a girl with, with Jamie Fox. I like a girl that wants no, no, that that wants me but doesn't need me." Oh, he said, "So it's so sexy." A girl that wants me but doesn't need me. If you say you need a girl, you're not you're not you're not ready for one. Oh. <laughs> if you need a woman, you you're not ready for one. <laughs> Come on. If you need her to feel at peace, for validation, for joy, no. Nah. You're not ready. That's what you call idolatry. You're idolizing people who can let you down and fail you. Why? Why should I do that? Why? Why? That's what I thought. <laughs> it's, got, it's, got a, it's got a real joke. That's what you call a drive-by sinner. No. Just, the guy came before you with the, riding on the bike. What, what's, what's, a sin? what, what's the meaning uh, of sin? A sinner is someone that, that, that disobeys God. No, that, sin is disobeying the in, Lord. In, God. In, intentionally disobeying God. That, that's, that's a sinner. You're intentionally disobeying God. I don't care about God. I don't want his word. I don't want his ways. Get out of here, God. That's a sinner right there. Oh, okay. I, I'm, I'm a saint. You're a saint? I'm a saint. Yes. So how are you going to call yourself a saint if you don't believe in God? 
I do believe in God. Oh, so what you mean? You don't believe in his ways and his word? I do. You do? Yes, I do. You believe in his law, statutes, and commandments? The what? His law, statutes, and commandments? Of course I do. Yes, I do. Because a guy earlier just came, just, just drove by and, and, and said, told me shut, shut the shut the f up, and I, and I said, I, and I said why? And he just came on running by. Can, 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 can talk, I'm talking real, real talk. I'm, I'm talking real dialogue with, with the brothers over here. Why? Why should I shut up? Why? What are you talking about? I'm talking about real life. I'm talking about I'm talking about men and men and women. Oh, about about love and romance and doing it better. What, what's, what, what is love and romance? That's words. That's words that man made. It's man made. Yeah. You're only supposed to love God. You so you shouldn't love people? Huh? So you shouldn't love people? Respect is better than love. But the Bible says love the Lord with no, all your heart. No, love the Lord with all thy heart. Uh-huh. And love your neighbor as you love yourself. Yeah. So, lo so you got to love people. All right, but that, but when you say the word, but see, when you put that word in context, love, it means to honor and respect. Uh -huh. Honor and respect. That's what that meaning of the word love means. Love okay. our neighbor. Okay. But right? It means to honor and respect them. Meaning, like, yeah. you, when you respect yourself, yeah. right? As a, a human is supposed to respect himself, yeah. right? you won't do certain things, right? Yeah. So when you when it says to honor thyself, to honor your neighbor as you do yourself, mm. basically means to do unto others as you would do unto yourself. Yeah. So the way you would treat yourself is the way you should treat your neighbor. Yeah. That's what the word love basically means. It's not the love like how people express love because, you know, love come and go. Right? Yeah. You know what I'm but respect is forever. Honor is forever until you break honor. Love come and go. Love that word love comes and go. It, it, it comes and go. Only only person like when you, when when God say love me. Yeah. What does it mean in the love? It means to fear, honor, and respect. Yeah. It means to okay. Fear. Check this out. When, when the Bible says love is patient, you know love is kind. Uh, love keeps the record of wrong. The word, What's yeah, up? What's up? God bless you, man. Good night, man. Yeah, nice talk. Nice talk. Word, Much love. God bless you. God bless you. Man. Context, yeah, 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 yeah. You see what I'm but okay, so the Bible says love is patient, love is kind, love rejoices in, 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 in good. Don't 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 love, don't we embody that? I, but I, when you speaking about love, yeah. In the Bible, yeah. That word love means to honor, fear, honor, and respect when it pertains to God. Yeah. That's what the word love means, because you know, because love could be so many things when you put it on an earthly. Yeah. Or put it on earth but that's what I'm saying face. though. I'm, I'm saying know, then love could be part of flesh. Mm. It, it, could be, it could be. It could be. It could be. But that, but, but that's like that, that's lust. But see, God, see, but see, yeah. see that. But they, love yeah. is contrary to the word. Lust yeah. Too. Yeah. But when you see, when you think about what God is, it's pure. It's beyond. Yeah. It, it's not a physical flesh thing mm. when you speak about when you speak about the love for God. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Because you got to think about it. Because He said Israel is, is you know, what I'm saying Israel is a, is, is a wife. Mm. You know what I'm saying? That she 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 went away, but then when she come back, he must he, he must accept his wife back. Yeah. He said Israel. Now there's men in Israel, right? Yeah. So is he talking about the men is their actual wives? No. He men. was speaking in a parable. Meaning, men. Yeah, men in men in Israel. That okay. He, like he was he's the command. You know, a wife is supposed to be. Yeah. Right. It's supposed to be the feminine aspect of things. Right. It's supposed to be under command. Right. Yeah. According to the Bible, right? Yeah, yeah. So when he says Israel is a wife, meaning that he's the authority over Israel. Mm. You know what I'm saying? As far as the aspect of, you know, as a wife. Mm. Not even that wife as I, I would go into it because, you know, <laughs> God does, doesn't doesn't break his own rules. If yeah. he made man rules, why would he turn around and break it? So the Bible says love is patient, love is kind, love rejoices in, in the truth. Don't, that's, aren't that's these all things, me, but, but that's... But that's defining love, though. Love is patient. Love is kind. Don't, don't don't we embody that every day with, with people, or, or no, are, are we able to? You can, be, you can be patient with people, kind of people. Like, yeah, you're yeah. All following the same aspect yeah. of, of like you know the yeah. laws of stuff. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. once y'all following the laws, the, 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 the laws or whatever according to the Bible, then yeah. that's where the love comes in. Yeah, yeah. Because that's where the love comes in. But when you take it into saying you take the love into your own context, yeah, yeah. That's not real. We, we we need the the biblical love that God's talking about. The biblical that's love. Real, that's real love. The real love, yeah, yeah. That's the love like, you know, you see you, 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 your neighbor, your a stranger, you know, your neighbor a stranger drop a thousand dollar bill right there. Uh oh. You don't you don't slide it under uh -oh. your pocket. Woo, you know, hey, come yo, on. Sir, yo, you dropped your money. That's that's deep right there, man. That's you deep. You're right, you're right, yeah. That's that's 
that's love. Yeah, yeah. Not the love where you mm, smooth. <laughs> that's not love. That, that's lust. That's like ero erotic, erotic, er eroticism. You know. That shit only lasts. It lasts for a while. You know. Uh, it lasts for a, for a moment. For a moment. Yeah, yeah. But but love but is deeper know, than that. Than just romance and stuff. Yeah. Love yeah, amen, amen. That's why you must turn your love to him because he said, look, y'all. Yeah. Because, you know, right now, we don't know. This, uh, we can be destroyed in the next five seconds. We can. We can, yeah. We don't even know. We don't even know. He said, when his, his son don't even know. Yeah. The time. <laughs> you understand? His son said, what? Yeah. He said, I don't even know the time. But he knows when his father says his time, he's yeah. definitely ready. Yeah. Because what I tell people that Jesus was the living embodiment of the Lord's life. Yeah, right yeah. Then it was the word. See, people think that Moses was the first person with the Lord's Sash of Commandments. No, it wasn't. Mm. It was. It was Adam. Mm. Adam, of yeah. Moses, yeah. Do you think Adam had a mother and a father? Or well, not an earthly. He had father. to have a mother and an earthly father. He, right? he, had, a, he had God. But yeah, but. Give him life. Yeah, but of course, God. But give him life. God said he blew the breath of life. What is the breath of life? Ah, see. That's, 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 that's the Greek word for uh, Numa. Numa. No, no. The, no. The breath of life, when you read the, um, what it says in the Bible, if you follow my laws, yeah. and commandments, what it does, it gives you life. Yeah, yeah. But if you don't follow them, what happens? Yeah. You get death, you get right? Death. Yeah. All right then. Yeah. So, when, Mo, when, no, when, when God blew the breath of life into uh, Adam's womb, what was he talking about? He gave him the whole statue of commandments. Mm. So now think about it. Now, people be like, nah, but he was naked, running around naked. No, he was not. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because mm -hmm. you got to think about it. Yeah. God, don't break so, his, God don't break his own laws. Wow. You understand what I'm saying? So why would he be running around naked? Yeah. Civilized? Yeah. He was naked because he, he went away from the, the life that God gave him. He yeah. Said, Look, I'm going to give you two. You got the tree of life. You got the tree of good and evil. Yeah. Right? But from the tree of life, you can always eat. What was he talking about? He was talking about the Lord's Statue of Commandments. Wow. If you stay with these Lord's Statues of Commandments, you can always eat forever. You'll always be good. Yeah. If you follow good and evil, what's good and evil? The ways of the world. Mm. That was the tree of good and evil. Yeah, yeah. That's, yeah. that's where you would have death. Mm. But she was scared. She was thinking like, as soon as she eat it, mm. you know, I would die. But the snake, mm. the serpent tongue, did what? Manipulated her and said, look, if you eat, I promise you, you won't die automatically. <laughs> Lying, so she man. ate it, she didn't die. Lying, man. You know what I'm saying? But yeah. what happened? That's when death fell, fell upon man because yeah. man was going to live forever. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Whoever came through Adam would have lived forever. All men came through Adam because, you know, all men came through Adam through Noah. Yeah, yeah. You understand know what I'm saying? So now, when, mm. when, when, um, when, uh, when he, uh, took, took on, you know, mm. good and evil. Yeah. She was following what? Idolatry. Because mm -hmm. you got to remember, it was other people. They wasn't the only two people in the, um, mm -hmm. in, 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 in the Garden of Eden. That, that's impossible. Mm -hmm. There was other people there. God represented them when you read into Ezekiel. Ezekiel mm -hmm. breaks down the Garden of Eden. Mm -hmm. He talked about the Sumerians being, being, being big trees with long bows hanging over um, other people, meaning that they mm -hmm. was a great mighty nation, right? Mm -hmm. So think about that. There was other people in there. Adam had a mother and a father, so did Eve. But Adam didn't want to marry Eve. Adam wanted to do what? He didn't want so to. So who's Adam and Eve's parents? Like, like if we go, if we keep going back to human, human evolution, human, you know, descendants, ancestors. I, I, I don't, I don't know. I, I'm thinking they, I think they did talk about Adam's father. I think they, I don't know. Don't give me the line. I don't mm -hmm. like to speak. Not that I, not that I read because I gotta read it again. because there must be a source, right? We know God is a source of life, right? Yeah. Okay. So but everything earthly bound, God is yeah, a father. God is a source. Yeah. So yeah, look, even there must even be, there Jesus, must be, there must be a first before the humans. There must Jesus, be a first. Look, look, people say, oh, God, yeah. God has sex with. Uh, <laughs> God has Mary. sex. <laughs> To make Jesus, right? <laughs> That's the only way you can make a baby, right? Yeah. You, God didn't just zap a, if you would have zapped anything. Bye. Like this, Later. It would have been a seed, right? <laughs> so where did the, what, what God promised David? Yeah. What God promised David? What did God promise David? King David. What did he promise King David? Um, he said, through you, my seed will only, he said, through, through, not my seed. through you, my seed will come through you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So. In Christ, it's, it's from the who, lens of David. Who's Joseph? Yeah. Joseph lineage, when you read Matthews and Joseph, when you read Matthews and um, John, it mm. gives you the lineage of 
of Joseph. Yeah, yeah. Where it tells you the kings that was in it, you remember? Yeah. There was no kingship. Yeah. No man of Judah no more. Mm. It was ruled by who? Wow. The Romans, right? Yeah. For the Romans, who was ruling over Jerusalem? The Greeks. Oh, the Greeks. Yeah, but who was who fought the Greeks before the, the, the Persians. No, not the Persians. The Persians fought the Greeks. The Maccabees. The Persians. The Maccabees. The Maccabees? Yeah, the hell remember remember the, the Greeks was the ones that started the Hellenistic. The, the, yeah, the, the, the yeah, no, the, the Persians too. But the Maccabees was the ones that started the revolution. Mm. Because you remember it was the father of Maccabee when they was putting um they was putting pigs on, on, on mm. the altar of God. Mm. And and one of the Israelites and one of the um Hellenistic uh, Greeks was like, yo, if you don't, you know, somebody put a worship and mm. when the um Hellenistic Israelite put the goat, I mean to put the pig, you know, which is unclean, you know what I'm saying, unclean flesh yeah. on the altar, that's when the father beat him to death. Yeah. See, they take that out. They take out the um, apocrypha out, out of the um, thing because in the apocrypha it tells you about war. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And, you know, they tell you the Bible is a book of, you know, I love you and you love me. I'll be like, shit, yeah, you ain't read the Bible good. God got demons under his control. You think the devil, he, 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 he asked him, what? He'd be like, man, I'm bored. What? I need something to happen. Matter of fact, the demon would come to him and be like, hey, I could go kill them people. They've been, they've been sending a whole lot. I could kill about 10,000 of them. God would be like, what the heck? So you think God, God works with demons? God works with every, who, who's above God? Who's above, think about it. Who's above mm -hmm. God? Who's above no, God? No, nobody. nobody. All right. Nobody. So who can, who can go against, who can war against somebody that created everything? Okay, check this out. <laughs> the Bible says light, light and darkness cannot fellowship, right? Don't demons represent, represent darkness? Everything that's evil in the world is, de is a demon, not an entity. Yeah, yeah, it is. Yeah. Does not God say, um, I, 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 is a time they hate? Yeah. When I want to hate, He does what He want to do, right? Yeah. That's what God said, right? He said, I love who I want to love, hate who I want to hate. Mm. Does He not say that in the Bible? Yeah. The, 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 all right, no, all right. So if it was a problem with heaven demons, how uh, when He called all, all, all entities, you know. You know, to uh, congregate amongst him, who came amongst him? The Talk, devil. You're talking about the Book of Job. <laughs> All right then. Yeah. He didn't say, "What the fuck you doing up here, bro?" Didn't I kick you out? <laughs> he didn't say that, did he? He just mm. said, "Hey, what's up? Oh shit, I ain't see you in mad long. What you been doing?" Mm. But the devil said, "I've been walking up and down to and fro." And he was like, "All right, so you you've been doing your job, basically. Um, have you seen my uh, have you seen my uh, mm. you know my my my, my, my servant think? Job, right?" Mm. He's like, yeah, he's like, he's a good man. He yeah. said, I bet you if you take your hedges from around him, what was the hedges? Hedges? What was the hedges around him? The, the, the hedges. The, that God, God God's, had hedges around God, God's protection, God's angels, God's uh, protection around That's him. right. Yeah. He said, if you remove them, mm. he said, then mm. I bet you <laughs> that I can make him yeah. uh, denounce you, basically. Yeah. But God so God God don't never take a bet that he ain't gonna win, right? <laughs> yeah. He said, Go ahead, do what you wanna do, but as long as you don't kill him. Yeah. yeah. Did the devil not obey all his rules? And this is supposed to be Satan, right? Did he, not Satan obey he, the rules that God gave him? He, he said, Do what you please, but as don't. long as you do not kill him. Yeah. Did not do what did okay, what happened? He, he saw everything. Did, 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 did he not obey the, did not obey God's laws that he gave him upon that time? Yeah, he did. All right then. But he, okay. So how do right. I? So how why, do I? Why, why, why didn't Why Satan obey God in in, in heaven? When it, I don't know when it doesn't say that he never did obey him in heaven. His job is to walk to and fro. Mm. That's his job. His job is to his job is to is to increase the sin. But I do know I do know that God Wait, just tell me allows... in the Bible, hold on, just tell me in the Bible mm -hmm. where God kicked out Satan. You gotta give me the verse. Get them out. Um You gotta give me the verse. Um, you look it up in your phone. I know the Bible said that I saw Satan as come down as lightning out of heaven. You see that you see that. No, he said he's seen it as Nephilim. Talking about, he's talking about Babylon. He wasn't talking about Satan as far as God, because you know, saying in the context, he was talking about the great city of Babylon. 
that he seen. Remember, that was during the time of Babylon. Remember, they was building the Tower of Babel. Everybody spoke one language. Then God and angels came down mm -hmm. and, and, and spent everybody and, and made everybody speak different languages. And destroyed the, um, the tower. Yeah. All right. Take tower of Babel. Yeah. So it you just gotta show me where God just kicked the angel out. Because if he kicked him out, how the fuck he get back up in the, um, heaven? <laughs> Think about that. That'll be a contradiction, right or wrong? Let me see. Hold because on. the Bible's not about a Bible's not a, a, a book of confusion now, right or wrong? It, it's right and exact. The Bible's definitely right and exact. Job, Job one verse one. Um, all right. So. Joel chapter 1 verse 6 There come a day when the sons of God came to present themselves before the Lord mm. And Satan came also among them mm. Note that If you read the verse yourself It doesn't exactly say where they were Read it again It says now there came a day when the sons of, sons of God came Who's to the sons of God? Not the sons of men. Who's the sons, sons of God? The sons of God. That's the angels. That's, yeah. That's the angels in the celestial lives. Yeah. That's, not that's, just, that's the celestial. That's, celestial not, yeah. that's not just angels. Yeah. That's the demons too, because they're celestial too. What, what, what is the purpose of a demon? Okay. Why did Jesus say to the Pharisees, "You are Why, not, you are not wait, of your, you are okay. of your father, the devil"? Boom. Listen, devil just means deceiver. Yeah. That's what devil means, right? Yeah. But look. So, so there's a look, distinction. Look, look, I'm gonna give you some. Remember when Jesus yeah. went into that town and it was yeah. the, um, the legion? Yeah. Did they not know who he was? They knew who he was. Why did? How did they know who he was? Yeah. How did they, they know, know who he was? How did they know who because he was? Because they're familiar with him. They're because all, they dealt with him before. They were in heaven. Yes, sir. They're in heaven, right? Yeah. Around. Of so, course. What are you saying that God does not have the angels and devils under God rules all? He's well, above all things. What, what it says in the Bible? There's no demons. God is above all things. Yeah, that's true. Things. But there's no demons in, in heaven right now. The demons are cast out of heaven because they rebelled against yeah, God. They, they ain't nobody rebelled. They rebelled against God? Humans is the only people that ever rebelled against God. Really? Yes. Only humans? Only humans. Only humans. We're going to go to that's, Revelation 12. Revelation 12. I mean, I mean Revelation 12. All right. Yeah. All right. So, it's a, it's a book of prophecy. Revelation 12. Revelations mean to reveal. 12 Revelations verse 4, yeah. It's basically the reveal to, reveal. It's so basically the it says, to um, John. Yeah. John the Revelator. He revealed to him on the island of Patmos. Remember, 70 years when he um took the, the, the he gave him a drink to poison him. Yeah. But he didn't die though. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Before he died, he got the prophecy. God yeah. came to him where? Well, how did God come to him? He came to him like basically in the, um, in the middle of the Check this out. Check this out. Revelation 12, verse 9. And the great dragon was cast out, that old serpent called the devil and Satan, which deceives the whole world. Okay, he was cast into okay. the into the earth. Okay, now so he was in heaven, so but he got cast out. No, no, no. It doesn't say he cast him out. It of says heaven. that. It says that. Say it, again. it says cast him out of where? Uh, where is it? Let me see. Yeah, he was cast out of heaven, out into the earth. Out he, into the and earth. And before oh. and before that, it, there was war in heaven. Let Michael and his angels. Yes. Let me see. There was Let me war. See there was war in heaven. Hear this version. Michael and angels fought against the dragon. Michael, what, what, Dragon, what, the devil. I see if that's King James. Fuck, that's the KJV. Let me see. That's what I deal with, the KJV. Okay. Mm -hmm. And that's on um, what? Oh, 12, 12 what? 12 verse 7. Yeah. So that's what we'll be out here hustling, about. Huh? You, you, you hustling? Oh, oh. <laughs> it, it got Re you. Revelation. Twelve verse seven, King James Version. And the dragon was wroth with with the woman. See, this is a, this is a this is allegory. Mm. It's not this not like this is allegory. See, now I'm gonna read the King. This is the King James. You said verse seventeen. No. Or verse seven. No, Revelation twelve. Twelve yeah, verse seventeen. Yeah, yeah. No, no, verse um seven. Oh my bad. Verse seven. Revelations 12, verse 7, King James Version. Keep going to 17. I don't know. Why? <laughs> <laughs> They're probably hearing you wrong, machine. <laughs> he said, and there 
there was a war in heaven, Michael and his angels, okay, which heaven? Cause you, which heaven? Yeah, because you know there's three heavens, you know that, right? Uh, yeah, I agree. Right or wrong? Yeah. There's the heaven we see, Yeah. then there's a heaven, that's his space. Yes, and then, then, and then the ultimate heaven. heaven. Yeah. And then there's more chambers to heaven than that, cause, but mm. who's above all of them heavens? God's above it all. All right, now, boom, God's now, I'm going to break this down. Mm. This, is a, this is a prophecy. You know that, right? Mm -hmm. This is a prophecy. No, the, this is a prophecy. This verse is a prophecy. It didn't happen yet. So yeah, there it, was war in heaven. There was there, war. No, but yeah, that's past I'm, tense. No, no, there was a war. It was a prophecy. And there was yeah. war in heaven. Not there was a war in heaven. There was war in heaven. This is a prophecy. Who's in heaven right now? Who's going back and forth to heaven right now? Who's in heaven now? God's in heaven. No, 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 not that heaven. He, he, who who's have, who's who going talking? back and forth from earth into heaven right now? Who's going back and forth? NASA. Who? NASA. N A S A. NASA. NASA. Who's NASA? NASA. NASA. Oh, the space, the space company. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, not, 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 not the heavenly heavenlies, but you talking about? They can't, they can't get there. They can't, they can't, of course not. Yeah, you talking about up there, past, past the atmosphere. Pa yeah. Okay, okay. Okay. That's prophecy. Okay. That's the, who you think they talking about? Okay. That old serpent. The old serpent called the devil and Satan. See, he, he was cast out. He's going to be cast out of it. See, you're not. Why was he cast out, though? Look, he, he deceived the whole world. That means he did something wrong. This is a wrong. prophecy. It, it, it's, 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 it's an, occur, it's an okay. occurring so why, so why didn't prophecy. So why didn't it say there will be war in heaven? Why didn't it say there was war in heaven? It didn't say there will be. So there was. There was a war in heaven. So it happened. It happened already. It no, was. So why did it say was? <laughs> there was there. There was war. Not there was a war. There was war. There was war. Yeah. And then guess who they gonna be fighting against? Michael and the angels. Michael and the angels. Oh, yeah, who you think they gonna be fighting against at the end of the war? How you think this world is gonna burn and fire? Nuclear holocaust. Remember how the world was drowned before? It was flooded mm -hmm. by rain, right? Yeah. God made a covenant with the earth, saying he wouldn't kill us by rain again. That's what the rainbow is for, right? That's what the true representation of the rainbow, the rainbow. is, right? Yeah. Not what it's represented now. No, no, no. <laughs> right. right? Yeah, okay. yeah. So now, the second time what happened when the sun comes, it's going to crack, crack the sky, right? Mm -hmm. It's going to crack what sky? Not going to crack the heavens above the heavens. Mm. What sky is going to crack? This sky right here. Yeah. Guess how he's going to, what he's going to crack? atmosphere, mm. solar sphere, mm. all of those, you know what I'm saying? Because he's going to be coming back in a physical form. Yeah. You know yeah. what I'm saying? So when he comes back in a physical form through yeah. Earth, that's why things is going to be destroyed. What do you think the sky is going to crack? Because when him, Michael, and the angels come, who do you think they're going to be fighting against? It's going to be Star Wars. This is Star Wars, bro. It's going to be Star Wars. They're trying to find weapons now. You don't think they know about the angels? You know the angels fly back. So you think when Christ returns, then the war is going to start? Mm -hmm. So... No, the war is starting now, but like the, the peak, because it's going to be a war, it's going to be over in one day. When, God, when Jesus comes, the war is only going to be a one-day war, right or wrong. It's only going to be one day. He's going to win it. Everybody knows who's going to win. See? One, everything a, has to play out. For the, everything a one-day war. Out. The war is going to be over in one day. Because the, Bible, gonna win it. the Bible says that when Christ returns, that everything is going to be burned up, and all the wicked... Are, are going to be destroyed at the brightness of his coming. So the way I see it, when Christ returns, there's no war. The wicked are, are just terror. They're destroyed. Christ not coming here to make war. He's praying. You he's, don't think he's going to listen, he, bro? A one day what war? No, it, it's, a, it's instant decimation when Christ listen, returns. Or he's going to destroy no. the earth in one day. Huh? It's going to be in one. Uh, everything's going to happen in one. Within day. one day. I agree. I, I agree with that. Everybody's going to be in lakes of fire, which is going to be nuclear holocaust. You know mm. that, right? God's going to make people. See, they you don't understand. Yeah, within, a, within, within God, a day. Within a God day. God gave man yeah. the idea to do what? Make nuclear weapons. Mm. He already got it set up. Mm. So when I mean, 
you got the knowledge of good and evil, so no, we do listen, a lot of things no, with evil that. But God sure do. got man set up for his own demise already. Mm. You know what I'm saying? This is all prophecy. So when they say the war in heaven, they're gonna be having they're gonna have spaceships, bro. They're gonna be having spaceships that shoot lasers and shit. What how many times they done you done they done spoke about CA recently in the past five years? How many mm. UFO sightings they've been seeing? Mm. Hundreds and thousands of them. What are the UFOs? Those are chariots. Mm. Think about it. When you read in Ezekiel, it gives you a description of a UFO. UFO. A, a, a circular sphere that can shoot back forth. You don't know which way it goes. Yeah. It goes back forth here. And every time you see what they got the sight of what you see, and it's gone, right or wrong. Have you ever seen them catch a UFO? I've never seen them catch a UFO yet. They, how never can they catch a chariot? How can, they, how can they catch God's chariots? Come on. I was saying God chariots are UFOs. You don't think so? Think about it. Mm. Going into Ezekiel, it give you a description of a UFO. It give you a description of UFOs, the angels, That's what chariots. it's called. They call them UFOs. I, I, I'm not even sure exactly how a chariot looks, but I know... The chariot it, it, is a circular sphere. It has, it has the colors in the middle, right? In the middle of the thing, right? I mean, it could be... No, no, no. It's, a, it's a, like a burning wheel, like a wheel of fire. It's a bright wheel. Oh, you say you say you're talking about chariots in the, in the book of Ezekiel? Yeah. Ezekiel. Ezekiel. Talking about the chariots. One. Said the chariot of the Lord, the Lord's Lord, all watching, big strong, come in from the north. Ezekiel. Wagons, wheels. No, 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 that's not it. No? No, no, he's talking about the burning. Is, is in Ezekiel? Is it even Ezekiel or Obadiah? <laughs> but I think it's Ezekiel. That's when he, because Ezekiel was in captivity when he was prophesizing, right? And he's talking about the angels as a scary sight. Like people think angels look like humans, but they don't. Oh, no, a angels are. Look, a scary sight. Er yeah, angels look very uh, formidable. <laughs> yeah. It has wings with eyes all over it and claws and yeah like an angel's natural form is very not you know it's not a good thing but it's in ezekiel though it talks about the cherries how Jeez. angels look yeah. that's what the ufos is <laughs> they never caught one how, yeah, how you can never catch one why can't we because they're god's chariots mm. you can't you can't you can't catch nothing like what god created so you've seen a UFO? You, 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 you claim to have seen a UFO? What, you, you never claim. seen one of God's cherries before? No. Nope. You say you're a man of God. I've never seen God's cherries. I've, I've read about it. I've seen a chariot. I mean, I've seen one, but I mean, like, that was years ago. Like, when I was younger, I've seen one of God's so, cherries so you, before. So you've seen a fiery chariot come out the sky? No, nah, it was actually passing over slow, but it was dark. Oh, it was dark. Oh. It was dark. It, it was, like, real low. I don't yeah. know who, but I think it was a chariot, though. Maybe, maybe. You know what I'm saying? But, yeah. He, mm. How you think? How you think he gets to see what's going on on Earth? How did God get to see? You think he got a crystal ball? God got eyes. But you think who, God got eyes. Who's they, they, his go, eyes? They, they go to and fro. Who's his eyes? Who's God's eyes? You think God needs people to, to help him see? It makes life <laughs> no, easy. No, man. God. It makes life easy. God can see it by his, his own see, strength, man. I mean, God if he wanted to. Yeah, if, if, he, if he wanted to, but. Well, why would he want to? It, he got it, things when he could create something to look for. Him. I mean, God has, God has messengers. I mean, God don't have to say, oh, please be my eyes you think about in it, China. No, no, he don't say, France. be my eyes. Look. Yeah. Did he not create the angels? All angels, Michael, all of them? Yeah. Don't yeah he has yeah. angels that have eyes all over his body? Yeah. Mm. It's in the Bible. Mm. Eyes all on the wings and stuff. I don't, I don't, I don't know about eyes on the wings, but but different faces. Like, like, no, no, like multiple, multiple wings faces. Has eyes on them. No, I'll get rid of that before. Yeah. It's eyes. I'll be back. How long are you going to be here? Uh, I'm not going to be here for very long. But it's in the Bible. I'm yeah. Half, it, it, wings has maybe, eyes on maybe half an hour more or so. I'm going to show you. <laughs> Yeah, I've been I've been out here for like four hours, three hours, so yeah, I've been out here for like three, three hours, four hours. I'm about to show you right now. 
<laughs> about to wrap it. Let's see. Be back. According, according to God. Yeah.